Hey, 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 guys, what's up? How we all, how we, how we all doing today? Ah, you play the thud. I can't imagine why you might want to do something like that. But yeah, uh, we're back with the game, the game I've been playing. Yeah. What does it take for one to become Breaking Bad? Uh, I'm glad that you're making uh, Breaking Bad references. <laughs> There's no elephant in the room or anything. Also, welcome official Mike Mike. Uh, I haven't seen you in a while. How have you been doing? Ooh, work had to be canceled due to rain. Yeah, it's been... I don't know how it is for everyone else, but for where I've been... Like, the weather's been crazy. Like, like it's been super... Weird. Like, it's... It'll be super, like, sunny one minute, and then it'll be, like... Just pouring down rain, like, the next. It's, it's, it's weird. That's good. You know what? Being a workaholic, it's a good trait to have, I feel like, anyways. Yeah, because it makes money. <laughs> Six days? Oh my god. Yeah, that- <laughs> that'll make money, alright. <laughs> but also... It's a good trait to have. Because the, um, whatever those are called, the people that hire people, employers, I'm gonna get rid of all these real quick. <laughs> this is stupid. There we go. Now you can all see me. Yeah, employers really like that. Um, cause, cause it, cause they, they like to hire people who work a lot. Uh, obviously, um, don't mind the the sound. By the way, I mean I was eating candy just now. <laughs> okay, now most employers you have either do uh, sixty nine. Oh, I see what you're saying. Oh. Yeah, you know what's funny is I've... <laughs> I've seen that number so many times in a joking context, I forget it, it actually refers to a thing. Anyways. I made this song, by the way. <laughs> well, I didn't compose it, but I, I still made it because <laughs> I was bored one day. <laughs> I've got a bunch of stuff like that. Hold on, <laughs> you want me to show you all the the Pizza Tower crossover songs I've made? Forgot you went live. Yeah, we are live. Ooh, welcome, Tree Sauce. I also didn't say welcome Izu, well, well, welcome, welcome you as well. Uh, I wanna, we'll get to, <laughs> we'll get to playing the game in a second. I just wanna show off all the things I made. I made this one. <laughs> if they can lie on their postings, why do I gotta play by the job? Fair enough. I keep eating candy, but I, I it, it probably sounds really annoying in the mic, so I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> I don't know, I, I like it. I, I already posted this one in a video, so y'all might have heard this one. You made a political YTP? Okay, <laughs> sounds cool. 
Okay, one more, one more, one more. I swear, this one's good though. You'll like this one. This is kind of fitting, because this is... This is from part five, and we're about to play Persona 5. Speaking of which... Stupid song out of here. Speaking of which, how about we play? The, how about we play the game? Let's do that. Ooh. <laughs> Forgot I did that. Okay. Unless anyone complains, I'll, I'll 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 keep it like this. Wait, no, I wanted it to be in full screen. That's why I put it on there. Yes. There we go. It's on Justin Trudeau. Tru I don't know how to pronounce that. I've heard the name, I, I I don't know anything about him, though. Okay. Uh... Yeah, I kind of forgot what we were doing before. It's a fine setup, it's not blocking anything. Yeah, I, I made sure to put the, the pancakes, uh... Made? Oh, are we doing that? Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Let's do that then. We'll do Operation Maid Watch. <laughs> And then we'll do Operation Akechi Watch. I really am glad that nobody's actually, like, said anything. <laughs> no, nobody's acknowledged anything of, uh, of, of this. Which is, uh, cool. Because I was planning on not doing the same. Was that evil laughter I just heard? Also, can you guys hear it? I just realized the audio is kind of low looking. I think I'll turn it up a little bit. Okay, that was a bad decision. There we go. So I, ha I have the audio turned up on the game, so. Should I buy a thousand dollar mystery box? Uh, I wouldn't, but. That's just my opinion. Whoa, I just walked into someone. Whoa. Uh. <clears throat> Wait a minute, how much money do I have? Oh, I didn't even realize. Okay. I guess I got some back that. Yeah, I didn't even realize. How much money did I make from uh, the job? Not that. I'm trying to. E yes, yes, that one. Yeah. Okay, go to here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, Central Street. It's better to buy what you know you're getting than wasting it on stuff you're not sure on. Hmm, that makes sense. Yay, wow, we're in the place. Alright, alright, we'll talk to you, I guess. Uh, the fan, of, the fan of these have finally made their big uh, pr prime time. Okay, wait, is prime time one word? I didn't know that. You know what? I'm also gonna do this. Oh my goodness! I ruined the thing. No, we're gonna turn all this off, and we'll we'll wait for him to show up. Once he shows up, we'll we'll turn it back on. Okay, I promise, I promise. Uh, the fan of the uh, info has started pouring into the fan site too. It's gonna be a, uh, uh, I'm gonna be a busy bee. <laughs> so we're. <laughs> I gotta get that annoying. Okay. <clears throat> so we're, we're executing Operation Maid Watch tonight for sure, right? Heck yeah, dude. All right. Sweet, I've been waiting for this. I've been waiting for this. I, I I think I used to have that as a sound alert. Sakamoto said to meet him over by his apartment. Uh, come on, follow me. I know I'm doing the voice differently. It's because I don't care. I don't care what he sounds like. What a small apartment. Uh, so, so we're really going to do this, huh? Uh, you think it'll be okay? Wait, where's Morgana? <laughs> I guess Joker left Morgana outside. I don't in the street, in the rain, in the cold. Operation Maid Watch, bro. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Operation Maid Watch. Well, 
If it turns out to be sketchy, we could just bail. The apartment's vacant, so it's not like we'll be messing with anyone's home. <laughs> what is this? T TCG players. Best quality is near mint, but I have bought near mint. Graded them, and they got tens. I'm gonna. I need to put my glasses on. I can't read anything. <laughs> yeah, okay. Apartments very good. Uh. Uh, you're a genius, Ryuji. Let's be nice to him. I like Ryuji. Oh! And look at that. Being nice gets you places. Who would have thought? Yeah, yeah, I know. Um. It's a thing. Sakamoto has a brain. Uh, wow, Mishima. Wow. Wow. You know what? That's so- that makes me so sad. I'm gonna get up from my chair and close the door that someone just opened. Hold on. <sighs> okay. I love Ryuji. He's a silly guy. He just be joking sometimes. Yeah. Yeah, he's cool. I don't- <sighs> He gets so much- So much flack. In real life and in the game. Apparently. I still haven't watched that one video I was talking about where apparently Ryuji's like not a fan favorite in Japan or whatever. Uh, but if that's the case, th then. Yup. Yeah. I didn't get the joke. Okay, give him a call. Oh, okay, they want me to do it. Or. Do it yourself. <laughs> That's a very Persona 3 response. I'm gonna go with leave it to me. I'm 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 the cool <laughs> the cool guy. Well, uh, thank you for calling. This is Victoria's housekeeping. Oh my goodness, we gotta oh my name is someone mentioned my name. What is up you okay wait, hold on. I gotta do the What is up you guys? I'm Meta7 and tonight we are gonna play Persona 5! Maybe Ryuji's actually really popular in Japan and the title's misleading. <laughs> it's just clickbait. <laughs> That'd be cool. I hope that's the case. Hey. Shush. Uh Is it this is the man's voice, right? Or is it I take it you're interested in our services then? Services? Is there anyone in particular you'd like to request? Uh, uh, any- anyone we want to request? What should we do, Makira? Mesa, do you like horseflies? Do you think horseflies should die? Uh, I don't know what's the difference between a horsefly and a normal fly, but I think all flies should be persecuted, in my opinion. But that's also why we got spiders, who I also think should die. I hate spiders! I know, they're helpful, they- oh, they get rid of the bugs, but they also bite me in my sleep. So, I do have a bit of a vendetta against spiders, and flies, so. <laughs> There's horses that can fly. Horse flies are big, annoying, and they bite. Oh, okay, then yeah, yeah, they need to- They need to, uh, not be alive anymore, I agree. I get this is the same answer, so sure. Very well. Let's see here. They suck your blood. That's horrible. We have a maid available in twenty minutes. May I ask for your address? Sheesh, this is really happening. <laughs> I can't do it. I- hold on, let me readjust the mic real quick. <clears throat> uh, uh, maid services? Wait, uh, or- Hey, uh, what should we have her do? I was thinking we, uh, start with some cooking. Of course, I wouldn't mind so, some of the other services either. <laughs> uh, should, should we hold a strategy meeting to discuss? They said 20 minutes, right? Uh, I gotta use the bathroom. 
Okay. Oh, uh, it's almost time. Uh, you you were in there for a while. Are you okay? Did you wash your hands? <laughs> look at the look he's giving him. He's like, boy, if you don't. Uh, I smacked one in midair with a rubber glove, hard enough to break its wing, and <laughs> sprayed it with herbicide, and it still didn't die. Oh, wow. It's like... <laughs> yeah, that's, that sounds pretty bad. He smacked it with a rubber glove. <laughs> I just I love the visual of someone smacking a fly with a rubber glove. And then it's still, and then it gets back up. Oh, that's like what, that's like in Spider-Verse. Remember in Spider-Verse, he gets squashed by the, by the kingpin, and then he gets back up. Anyways. Uh, what? Who, me? Y you're really nervous. Uh, 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 are high school uh, students even allowed to use this type of service? I mean, they didn't ask, so. Uh? What? <laughs> what do you mean, huh? Well, you should have researched it. What if they find out who we are? Wait. Uh, how should I know? But uh, why would... Why would how old you are matter when it comes to housekeeping? It, we... We... Uh, man. We would have been screwed if your number had showed up on their caller ID. Bling blong. Okay, what's her voice gonna be? I know who it is. Uh, I just forgot the voice that I gave her before. Uh... Good evening. <laughs> I can't, I can't, I... I'll wait until, like, her voice lines show up and then I can... Good evening. I'm from the housekeeping service. Huh? What? Uh, already? She's five minutes early. Well, what do we do? I I'm not mentally prepared. Oh, the door's unlocked. Uh, may I come in? Uh, I can't do this. My stomach's acting up and my hands are all sweaty. Oh, my bad, man. Okay. My bad, man. You handle the rest and, and don't let her find out you're a high school student. I've I've got like I've uh, I've got your back just from way back, like from the balcony. <laughs> What? Uh, what? I, I can't do this either. Karusev, I'll leave it to you. Oh, there she is. Ryuji and Mishima. M Mishima. I forget how you're... Fled to the balcony. Uh, excuse me. Oh, there you are. Welcome home, master. Mmm. <clears throat> mmm. Mmm. This is why I didn't want to do Maid Watch. <laughs> this is why I delayed it. Welcome home, Master. Uh, I'm gonna fill your tired heart full of lovely energy. Uh, meow. I'm Becky, and I have the pleasure of surfing you today. Um... <laughs> Can I request someone else? That would be my reaction after hearing that. Ew! Yeah, why, why not? <laughs> nice to meet <me. laughs> uh, We're gonna get along so well, meow. Oh my, how thoughtless of me. I should explain our services to you, master. Uh, what? would you like me to do today? The basics include cooking, cleaning, laundry, but there are other services uh, we provide if you desire. Herm, you, uh, you look young, master. Are you perhaps in high school? I'm a dad. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I don't know which one the, uh, This one's funny though This one's more believable But this one's funny <laughs> This one <laughs> My dad <laughs> Whoa your skin's so healthy You're not lying to me are you? Her 
confirm. Uh, I'll wait to provide those other services until you've matured a bit, Master. So, I'll be going now. Wait, you're not even gonna clean the house? Huh? Okay. Well, what? No! Quiet! Is, is someone there? Oh, no. You run, Mishima. Uh, Mishima Sak Sakamoto-kun. How does she know their names? And you? Hmm. What? It's the teacher. <laughs> Can't believe the, the skeleton in the closet started talking. I think that's supposed to be the balcony. <laughs> uh, did you request me specifically? <laughs> Wait, are you? <laughs> oh no, that's all right. How, how would you, how would you, uh, how would you know me? This is our first meeting. Yes, the first time ever, Master. Ugh, this is unbelievable. Yes, it's me, your homeroom teacher. Plays the the Law and Order, Jun Jun, you know that sound effect. Uh, I'm so done. I can't believe I got caught by some of my own students. I should have taken a job outside of the city. But I needed it to be oh <laughs> close to school so I could get there after I finished work. Hey. Uh, who did you hear about this from? <laughs> That's not what your hair looks like in, in the model. What? A oh, it was Miss Ch Chono, wasn't it? That, uh, is that a bad word? I'm, I'm, I'm going to be safe and not say it. Miss Chono, the English teacher, she's been snooping on all the teachers ever since that incident with Mr. Kamoshida. Can't believe how lazy Atlas is. Yeah, they made like a hundred hour game, a hundred hour long game, but they didn't even switch out the sprites with their close it. Like, unbelievable. Maid lady. <laughs> I thought you said my lady for a second. Uh, are you gonna- shut up. Are you gonna tell Miss Chono about this? I thought you just said that I got the information from her. Uh, that's up to you. Uh, sure. I don't know what I don't know what that's supposed to imply. Hey, if you're gonna side with the teacher, side by me. I I'm in charge of your class after all. And if you promise not to tell Miss Chono about this, I'll do anything for you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> anything. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Both of these sound kind of mean. <laughs> if you th if if he's saying it sarcastically, he's like, "Ah, if only uh, I wonder what uh, I wonder what what I'm gonna do about this one, huh?" Uh, yeah, I don't know. Murakamashita, good times uh, when we broke his knees. I don't worry. Very soon we're gonna break someone else's knees as well. Hey. Hey. Hey, it won't be any better for you if people find out that you called a maid service. Ooh, uh, this isn't even your home address to begin with, is it? I guess you at least thought about that. Well, I'll promise to keep this a secret too, so why don't we both forget this ever happened? I'll treat this as if uh, you had cancelled, so you won't have to pay anything, okay? On that note, I'll be leaving. Oh, okay, with your... A uh, different hairstyle in the cut in. Okay. Don't say anything about this at school, okay? Just act as if nothing ever happened. Got it? Okay, bye. Bye, Miss Teacher. I suddenly feel exhausted. I want to go home. Yeah, where did Ryuji and the other guy go? Did they jump off the balcony? Like, how did they, <laughs> how did they get out? Alright then. Oh my god, we went up like 6%. Since last time I checked, they died. That's so sad. Hey, wait, isn't this the one place? Why is it showing this as an establishing shot? All right, I'm gonna eat some. I got I got some high shoe here, a little bit. This one. Actually, I think I got two packets. <sighs> Ugh, it's so gross and humid. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't think about the fact that I'm chewing and I won't be able to, um, hold on. 
<gasps> Why is this guy playing on a PSP? Is he playing Persona Portable? Uh, now for today. <laughs> now for today's train news. Today's headlines are. Hotspots of Tokyo. Penguin Sniper has opened for business in Kishi Joji. I already knew that. What's Penguin Sniper, you ask? A zoo? A pet shop? No, it's a trendy lounge for darts and billards. He's playing P4 Golden on his Vita. Oh, uh, okay, that does more, look more like a Vita. Whether it's alone or in a group, how you play is up to you. Oh, uh, it's gonna be... It's that lounge. Next time we go, I'm gonna play darts too. Sure you will, with your paws. Still, uh, there sure are a lot of shops in Kichijoji. We should take our time and look around uh, when we get the chance. Ba, ba, ba. Cool. <laughs> Look at those two, those two, uh, clones in, in the background. Those guys are my favorite characters. Voided! Uh, the response to Monorami's press conference was huge. Everyone's talking about the calling card. Uh, girls are checking me out today. Maybe they can't send, help us sense my overflowing, uh, Phantom Thief charisma. Did he really just say Riz? Ryuji's got Riz. I'm not gonna lie about that. Oh, jeez. Am I finally starting to be popular with all the, uh, the fly hun? Oh, no. Uh, what's wrong? For real? <laughs> what's wrong? My uniform, man. That's what. We're supposed to switch to summer uniforms today. I knew people were looking at me. Oh, uh, G-G-G-G Namit, G-G Willikers. I gotta go home and change, so you, so you go on ahead. I mean, you could just still wear it. It's not that weird. The only reason you didn't notice is because it's not really hot yet, so. <laughs> Damn thief after uh, heist. Let's lay low. Morgana playing darts. It's natural for cat to play this, right? Oh, oh yeah, I guess that's, that's also a thing. Nah, cats play darts in Japan. It's a different country. Add that to the for real count. I forgot what number we're on. I, hey, that's the creepy girl. That's the stalker girl. That's a cool detail. She's my favorite character. Anyways, uh, yeah, I actually just have. When I eventually do edit this all into a whole thing, I'll I'll put I'll do the whole counter thing. I don't know. Holy she is you're pale. Short sleeves are n so not good for you. Shut up. Uh, geez. Anyway, did you catch the news yesterday? Watching that famous artist cry his eyes all over the artwork he's stolen. Same thing happened to Kilmashita, right? Both were we got weird calling cards, too. If you ask me, the same person is behind this. The, n <laughs> the news this morning said a group called Persona 5 are the ones behind the cards. I mean, how they get people to confess, I... I wonder how they get people to confess. I mean, they can't literally be stealing hearts. Blackmail, maybe? Look, it's Ryuji. Ah, this is, this is a cool detail. Gah, made, made it. Uh, er, sprinting first thing in the morning was a bad idea. <laughs> Wait a minute. All he did was take off his jacket. He's not even wearing the, the shirt. He didn't even change. It's the same. Whatever. Well, that's definitely my personal best by by a lot. See, they changed his little talking sprites for for that costume change. Uh oh. How are things going in regard to that matter we spoke of earlier? I have nothing to report yet. Sorry, I wanted to uh. I figured while there's a scene where there's dialogue in mine as well. Snack a little. Nothing at all? How many students are there who could provoke a teacher? I've already narrowed it down. I just can't get any solid evidence. <sighs> Ugh. 
You knew, didn't you? About Mr. Kamashita sexually harassing students. Sir! <laughs> He's not even gonna deny it. What will come of you asking that? This investigation is for a just cause, correct? I believe I understand how flustered this must be making you. I'm sure it was truly shocking for you as student council president to see a peer attempt suicide. I don't know if that's really what she's getting at, but okay. Yes. We must provide a school environment where all students can feel at ease. Hmm, and that's why I hired the one guy. That is the most pressing issue we have to tackle at the moment. So that's your reason behind this investigation on the Phantom Thieves of Hearts? Oh yes, that's why, that's, see, that's why I knew about the Kamoshida and didn't tell anyone. It's because they wanted to protect the students, yes. We don't even that know makes if sense. they truly exist. Why are you... You heard about the incident with that Madarami fellow, I assume? They said there was a similar calling card to the one used in Mr. Komashita's case. I wish to believe that this is unrelated to our students. Yes. That is where I stand. I suggest you devote your energy to the task at hand, not unnecessary questions. Yeah, stupid idiot child. <laughs> Why would he say that? It's so mean. Kamashita was a bait set up by the principal, no way. Or is that the idea? Did you see Madarame's press conference? <laughs> they, 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 they drew him on the, on the shock board. <laughs> you mean that guy who was all like, How could I possibly <laughs> apologize for what I've done? Oh. <laughs> Actually how people talk about, <laughs> talk about YouTube apologies. I think it was really those phantom thieves? You know, the whole stealing your heart thing? That? Uh, there's no way. But then again, it seems too convenient for it all to just be coincidence. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! Okay. Is he gonna say anything? I guess not. How's it going? Have you found our next big target? I just started looking yesterday. No way I'm gonna find one that quick. I still don't get- okay. What part of him did he change other than taking off the jacket? Because that's all he did is he took off the jacket. He could have just taken it off at school and then put it in his locker until it was time to leave. He didn't have to go home to put, put his jacket away and then come back. Uh, fun fact, I believe the crying is reference to a Japanese meme, something about some guy doing apology to a similar degree. Oh, that's really cool if that's the case. <laughs> uh. That's true. And hold on, she has a jacket as well. She just has it wrapped. A, uh, she did the whole j wrap the jacket around your waist thing. By the way, I decided on the TV station. What about you two? My TV station. Huh? Oh, okay. The oh crap! The social studies trip. Oh, I just want to ditch it. <laughs> You'd better go to your school activities. Didn't I tell you not to draw attention to yourselves? Yeah, Ryuji. Wouldn't me suddenly turn it into a good student stand out more? <laughs> That's a good point, actually. Bickering and go. Then let's all choose the TV station. I heard we're gonna get to watch them tape a show. Maybe there'll be actresses there. <laughs> That's a good reaction image. Be a big shot. <sighs> so like. So, like, do it then. That's Ryuji's reaction to you saying that. Oh, well. Not like I got anything better to do than waiting for info to come in online. Plus, Morgana's right. Showing up will keep the teachers from getting all suspicious of me. I, yeah, you know what? I didn't even think about this. Well, what are you... Ryuji. If you want to ditch the trip, what are you going to do? Exactly. What are you gonna ditch it to go do? Uh, it's not like you have anything going on. <laughs> I think it'd be more boring if you just like went home instead of like went on the trip. All right, I'm gonna head back. He's gonna be gaming. Oh yeah, I guess he would. That guy is such 
such an idiot. <laughs> nothing happens. Uh, shut up, Morgan. Oh my goodness. There, go there goes the dog again. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna go check on him. <laughs> Just to make sure, I know he's just, it's cause my parents are coming home, but I'll, I'll check it. Okay, I'm back. Wow, it really took him so long to um, text back, huh? I've got an ice cube in my mouth, by the way. <laughs> um, oh yeah, I got. Hold on. Never chew on ice, kids. Don't be like me. Okay. Literally stop. Or right. feels pretty great having everyone talking about us, huh? Madarami is the only topic of conversation at my school. And as a, I'm his pupil. Most of my peers have chosen to ignore me. Wait, why? Wouldn't they want to ask you about it? Wouldn't you be like? That doesn't make sense. For real? That's BS. Uh, are you gonna be okay? There's no need to worry. They had already been treating me differently from others as it stood. This is nothing new to me. Okay, then. More importantly, do we have any leads on our next mission? You kidding? There's no way, uh, there's no way we'd fly a target that quick. So momentous we go. Great idea. I will keep myself free. Please tell me if anything comes up. Y'all heard of the Divine Comedy? Are you listening? <laughs> yeah, that- yeah. It's- it's really funny. Yusuke is too base for his peers. Yeah. Anyways. The Crucif! <laughs> you, pay attention! Is that how you listen when someone's talking to you? Okay, is this when the- I don't- I'm pretty sure you need, like, enough things to, like, dodge the, the thing. I know what he's gonna do. I don't know how to- Oh, I actually don't- whoa! Okay, I was, like, pressing the X button because I thought, okay, maybe it's gonna be the X button. I gotta press, but no, he just dodged it on his own. That was an epic dodge. I thought it said epic doggo for a second. Ugh. I can't believe he dodged uh, uh, that guy's throw. Is he a ninja? <laughs> well, whatever. Moving on. <laughs> There's no point to that. Okay, it's because of my charm. You can also wiggle the stick for better odds of dodging. Oh, that's what it is. Okay, wiggle the stick. Got it. Wait, which stick? I got 
I'll, I'll guess I'll do both of them. Oh, you, you got the entire class's attention. Your charm has definitely increased. Okay. I have to remember that for next time. But the problem is next time is going to be a while from now, so... Might not even remember. Purgatorio and Paradise was better than Inferno. What? Inferno is most laughable. Oh, hey, it's you. Senpai. Yeah, hold on. I'm talking about Divine Comedy. Uh... Mm, I guess that's fair. I Yeah, you know what? I kind of agree with you. Inferno is, like, the most, like, notorious, I feel. Or the, um... How do you say it? It's the most iconic, but yeah, I I, I kind of like I kind of like Paradiso, Parad Paradiso and Purgatorio, a little better. But I don't know. I guess I have to. Technically, I've never actually read it. I've just seen Wendigoon's videos on it, so I don't know. Inferno is more laughable and offensive, but the others are actually good writing. <laughs> Yeah, because I'm thinking back on it. A lot of it's just like, ah, you're from Rome? You deserve to be here. <laughs> it's just a bunch of, it's just a bunch of the, the, uh, the writer just being like, ugh, this type of people. I hope, I don't like these people. My favorite part of Inferno is when Dante said, what a divine comedy. Feel the Inferno, you sinner. He did say that, yeah. Ah, Kuzu Kuzu Surprise. What a pleasant surprise! Oh wait, she's actually saying it's really it. really pouring down, isn't it? I thought something like this would happen. Did you? I mean, it was raining earlier, so yeah, I guess you would have uh, seen that coming. So I snuck a collapsible umbrella into your bag. Oh, that's... Okay. Uh... <laughs> uh, I'll, I don't want to be nice to Morgana, but I'll be nice. But, like, wouldn't she hear this and be like, huh? Who are you talking to? Uh, Dante just sucking Julius Caesar's. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> he did do that. Uh, I'll say thanks so much. Well, you do carry me around in your bag all the time. I've got to show my appreciation somehow. Well, see you around. Yeah, I was gonna say, where's your umbrella? Unfortunately, I forgot it. What? I would never make that mistake. Fang Fiction really had an epic start, start thanks to that guy. Yeah. I don't know how to add to the <laughs> joke. It really is just fan fiction. Dante going through the afterlife. Uh, to go find a girl who doesn't even know he exists. She's written to be his lover in the story. Yeah, isn't she also supposed to be a stand-in for, like, Jesus or something? I forget. Oh, yeah, that's the fun that's the funniest thing. Is the Yeah, that's right. Dante is the author, but he's also the main character. So it's not just the first ever fan fiction. It's also the first ever... Um... What's it called? Self-insert character but it's fine I'll barely get wet if I run to the station it's <laughs> a good if point anything, it'll make for good training oh yeah yeah she's gonna dodge the rain like in Toho that that one Toho meme uh huh what do what you what, what? <laughs> that sounds more like a threat you want a piece of this does he mean the umbrella I'll just say that Huh? But how are... Oh, are you offering to share your umbrella? Yeah, maybe. I don't know. That'd be wonderful. Thank you so much. No, I was gonna split it in half. That's how I share umbrellas. Oh yeah, the umbrella transition. I remember that. Thanks again for letting me join you. Hey, wait a minute. Right, we're in the same month as this, and yeah, it's raining. Uh, in this month as well. Dude, okay, we got like... Let's see, it's the 14th right now. Uh, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay, eight more in-game days, and then we'll be caught up with real life. To be honest, prelims are coming up soon, so I didn't want to take any chances of getting sick. Uh, don't know what that means, so I'm gonna ask. Oh, 
the preliminary competition for gymnastics. Two huge competitions are coming up. One at the beginning of summer and one near the end. You went to rain. It, it um I'm gonna be honest, I don't like the rain during the summer. Cause because then the water's hot. <laughs> or at the very least it's humid. And and then it makes it th then like what's the point of the rain? You know, the rain's supposed to make it cold, and then it just makes it hot. <gasps> Welcome Leo and S Kennedy, how are you doing? Oh my goodness. That was literally my fault. Uh anyways, I didn't hear what she just said. Uh, yeah. If I'm going to participate in the prelims, I have to be selected as my club's representative. So I don't know what a prelim is. And there's a qualifier meet to determine who that rep will be. It's my dream to compete in gymnastics on the global level. So I plan on maintaining a strict training regimen with my coach. Uh, I'll cheer you on. I'd be invincible if I had you cheering me on, senpai. <laughs> cool. Is she gonna turn out to be like a villain or something? Actually, don't tell me. <laughs> I don't know why. I just as soon as she said that, I was thinking like, this is. I know Joker's got that riz, but this is too suspicious. <laughs> you know what I mean? Uh, but don't don't uh, don't spoil it or anything. Oh, we're already at the station. What? Could have sworn we were just walking in front of the same background. I'll be fine from here out. I can't thank you enough for today. I swear I'll return the favor some. Some. Hey, isn't that Yoshizawa? What? <laughs> what? Every time I hear Senpai, I think of Yandere Simulator. <sighs> yeah, that game ruined like every depiction of Japan ever. <laughs> Cause I'm the same way. I used to think. I used to think you. So what senpai actually means is like, you know, you're superior, you're upper classmen, that kind of stuff. But like, uh, when I heard it in that game, I thought it meant like, oh, senpai means like your lover or something. Cause that's how it sounds like. That's the whole notice me senpai thing. Can't say senior anymore. <laughs> Which fun fact. The opposite of senpai is kohai. That refers to the opposite. That refers to th that would be yeah. So Yoshizawa here would refer to Joker as senpai, and Joker would refer to her as kohai. But um, kohai is not used as much because in Japan there's like a whole honorific system where it's like you would normally specify when it's someone above you but you wouldn't specify if it's someone below you you would only use that if you're referring to it in like the third person so like ah this here's my kohai you wouldn't say something like hello there my kohai you would just say hey but then oh my goodness uh thank you for the follow rice lover also welcome to the stream i hope you're having a, a lovely day I remember in the Divine Comedy when Dante said, OMG Virgil Senpai. I do remember that as well, and then Virgil's like, Boy, STFU. That's what he said. I'm not gonna say the actual word, because that would be bad. You mean the honors gymnast? <laughs> okay, Nanako. She gets the VIP treatment at school, and a boyfriend to escort her around? <laughs> Sorry, my favorite insult in any media is to say that someone has, like, a boyfriend or a girlfriend. It's like, the, it reminds me of, like, that that clip in, in the, the first Sam Raimi Spider-Man where, where it's... <laughs> <laughs> where, where he's fighting against the the one guy who, the, who's got, the, like, the... the thing. I don't know, um... What, what are the... I don't know, he's fighting in a guy in like a, a, a fighting ring, and then he, and he's like, Nice outfit, did your boyfriend make that for you? <laughs> it's like not even cool, but it's just funny. <laughs> Virtual really said, you can't stop this, Dante. It is uncertain whether you'll be going to Purgatorio or Paradiso at this point. I don't even get the reference. Anyways, uh... 
Miss Special Snowflake sure is living on easy street. Ooh, you can't say that. <laughs> okay, goodbye. I'm sorry, you shouldn't have to deal with a misunderstanding like that. Nah, it's cool. I deal with way worse. Don't worry. If anything, this is a compliment. Uh, why would I say sorry? I'll say don't worry. Don't worry about that. Yeah, you're right. The same thing Actually, in class too. People are often wary of me because I'm an honor student. Yeah, I should I just now realize? Actually, yeah, Joker should apologize because if anything, his his reputation is bringing her down. I love that line. Nice outfit. <laughs> Did your boyfriend make that for you? <laughs> yeah, it's it's great. <laughs> the school's expecting me to attain strong results in the upcoming competitions too. They even told me I didn't have to participate in the cleanup event. But I just don't like getting special treatment. Oh, excuse me. My father's calling. Hello, Dad? What was that? Uh, sorry, my phone's been acting up lately. It's okay. Thanks. Mm-hmm. I'll see you later. Okay, that was important. Thank you for- thank you, game. <laughs> about that he asked if I needed a ride since it's raining a bit overprotective don't you think I wonder if the father's gonna come up later <laughs> see I I'm I, I know these things I'm picking up on these things um oh yeah Joker doesn't have parents so uh I'll say you know what yeah, you got a great dad. The the fact that he's offering to give you a ride, that's nice. Yes, I definitely agree. The dad appears in the third semester. Ooh, okay. Well, I have to get to practice, so it's time for me to go. Thanks so much for today. Imagine if he's... Oh, I didn't mean to... Okay, goodbye. Imagine if he's the, 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 the new, like, boss palace guy. Or something. I actually shouldn't say that. That might even that that might actually come true. Seems pretty rough. Seems pretty rough. Uh, Morgana, you're a cat, not a dog. Don't say rough like that. Okay. Uh, but never mind that. Having what fur is the worst. Try to keep me under the umbrella, would you? <laughs> oh my. Uh, hey, I found some great intel. Uh, th this time, it, it's bullying by a uh, Kosei student they call a queen. She's been ordering around a male student who goes by the name M, kind of like the M and S and M. Nah, I... Yeah, I... I, I think I know what the letter M means, Mishima. I, Go back to school and search for Ka Kawikama to start her confidant. Oh, uh, do I have to? Um. Does M stand for Mishima? Yeah, exactly. It's literally your name. That's a secret. Okay. <laughs> anyway, here are the details. Uh, the girl acting like a queen is he Hikari Shimizu. I wonder if it's more likely that a girl will turn out like that if she has an S in an initial. Mishima, you really... I'd love to hurl insults on you, but the train announcer keeps blaring in my ear. Uh, well, I already posted the warning, so you should... Request receive. Yeah, I mean, I know if someone at the... Okay, the game's frozen. I know of someone at the school who goes by Queen, but she doesn't go by that name yet, so... Is it really gonna... Okay. Cool, well, we haven't had this in a while, so we should be grateful. Let me just check this out. Okay, this one's called... Caramel? Wait, I can't read the... It's an Oreo thing. It's like... What is this called? I can't see... It just says Oreo Oreo. Uh... You know, I'm not gonna eat this because I don't know what this is. Uh, 
Is that Bendy from Bendy and the Ink Machine in the background? I just noticed that. I think I already made that joke at some point, but... Uh, yeah, there's Bendy. Hmm. <sighs> cool, okay, um... Yeah. Who cares? <laughs> Who cares? What? I just came from here. Are you kidding me? Look at these clones. Anyways, uh... Take this to the thing. <laughs> Actually, I'm gonna save first. Because it's being weird. What? It won't let me save. You know what? Fine. Uh, yeah. Take me to Elmo. Okay. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. Okay, I, I see. I see where I have to go. I need to go to... Here. What if he he never bendy on those ink machines? That'd be... Why am I in here? Okay, whatever. It's gonna do this thing, and then I'll be able to save. Uh... Look at that meme over there. That's cool. Why would you leave your belongings on the desk? Someone's gonna steal them. Oh, in unless oh my God. we're in Japan or where stealing doesn't exist. You know, that's a, that's a uh, that's a literal fact. And two, the the biggest crime in Japan is theft. And the two biggest items that get stolen in Japan are umbrellas and bicycles. And and the first one's not even like on purpose. Um it's because in a lot of like stores and stuff, um, whenever it's raining and you bring around um an umbrella, uh they have like a little cubby thing like at the front of like a store where you put your umbrella so oftentimes people will accidentally grab the wrong umbrella so so umbrellas are often stolen but there's even then they're stolen on accident they literally it, it's literally an accidental crime <laughs> the only actual crime that happens in japan or the the biggest one is just bicycle theft How long did it take the last time? I think it was like, uh... <gasps> I don't remember... Okay, you know what? I've been wanting to talk more about this, um... On the th wait, what was this? Okay, better question. Why would anyone keep a cat in a backpack? Uh, then again, Miles does that in Miles Morales. Wait, does he? Keeps a cat in his backpack? Okay, I've never read the comics, so I don't know. Yeah, uh, I don't know. He just does. In the game, he does. Oh. I don't remember that. But yeah, I don't know. I... I think the, the actual reason is just because cats aren't allowed in the school. So in order to carry him along, he has to conceal him in the bag. Except he's not very well concealed because you can clearly see him, his head poking out. So... I don't know. I don't know what the, what's the thought process behind that. Okay, I want to talk about this. Persona 3 Remake. I mentioned it a few times uh, in the past streams, but I I, did, I I wanted to go more into like detail about it. What what are you you people's like theories about it? Because I I I mean, for the most part, it's a remake, right? It, it or a remaster, I believe. I think remake is a different thing. This game right here is a remake, but I think pers the Reloaded is meant to be a remaster, which is essentially to say it's the same game, but with updated visuals and stuff. Um, 
but I'm wondering, I'm wondering if they are going to do something different. Like if they're going to change the story any bit, because the problem with Persona 3 that we've always had until now is that there's never been like, it, finally, there's never been a, def a definitive version of it. It's always been there's Persona 3 and then there's FES and then there's Portable and then, you know, no one knows which one's canon. I think the P re P3 remaster is going to me. Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah, it's definitely going to be like it's going to take some things from Persona 5. I feel like I mean it already kind of the the UI and visual style is already reminiscent of 5. So it's definitely going to be a lot of that in the gameplay side of things. But what I what I'm wondering the most Hey yo! <laughs> Let's get out of here. What I'm wondering the most, though. Oh hey. <laughs> oh, that's Miss Chono. Oh, I remember. Or Chowno. I don't. Oh, there she is. Where are you going? What? Hi. <laughs> okay. Cool. There's a lot of students here. If you're real, I just heard someone say that. Yeah, but, um... What was I gonna say? Yeah, because the, the, the main thing is that, like... Uh... The UI, like, the, the main menu. We haven't seen a lot of it, but, like, in that video, it shows, like... It, by the way... It looks absolutely beautiful, I have to say. It looks really good. I really, I really want to see what they do with all the menus and stuff, because it, it looks amazing, but it, it, it has to do with, like, water, it seems. Like, the main theme of the menu, it seems, is, like, water-based. And that's strange, because... The original doesn't have anything to do with water, unless you count the time where they go to the beach, or even the hot spring. So I'm wondering if they change the plot in any way that involves water. It could also just be because water's blue, and the game, the whole color is blue. Much like how this one, the main color's red. So I don't know. I. Maybe they might change some things. I don't know. There's a lot of water. I can't wait for the underwater dungeon. Yeah, that might be a thing. I don't know. Anyways, let's talk to these, uh, these, uh, weirdos. Oh, Miss Kawakami. I already know. Kawakami's been driven to a corner by Chudo. Uh, I'm just gonna call it Chorno. <laughs> Jorno. Ah. Well, let's talk to her so we can help her out. Excuse me, teacher. I need to talk to you. As I've been saying, uh, get home safely, Karusevkun. Uh, uh, well then, I have another matter to attend to, so I must have to excuse myself. No, we're not done. Fi we're not finished talking yet. Uh, but I. So... Uh, so. There's been a series of scandals on this campus. Uh, we. We're all being called into question. And yet you leave work earlier than anyone, and you barely make it to the faculty meetings. Explain yourself. Don't tell me you're out running around at night. Mm. Kamakami's been grilled. <laughs> She's been roasted. She says she'd do anything if we helped her out, so let's clear out your, uh, her suspicions. The school's closing soon, Mr. Krusev. Head to on home before it gets late. Or did you need something from Miss Kawakami? I have a question for her. What? 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 Uh, oh, 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 you, you, you have another question. <laughs> another question? Th th that's right. Krusev's uh, kun's been uh, uh, questions are complicated, so I, I, I take time at night to help him. So you're giving individual lessons outside of school hours, hmm. What passion! You are the ideal teacher! 
A passionate teacher is... <laughs> I don't know why it turned into like a British voice. I feel like it kind of fits her. A passionate teacher is exactly what we need at this school. I'm sorry for suspecting you. Well then, keep up the hard work, you two. Hmm. She just kind of convinced herself. <laughs> but that did clear up her suspicion, so thanks. Would you come with me for a bit? Uh-oh. -uh. I can't talk about this at school. Uh, this is the address and phone number of my night job. I received Kawakami's phone number. Ooh! Call at night and request me. Uh, just be careful that it doesn't show up in your call history though, okay? Hey! Yeah, you did it! Uh, no, no call history means a public telephone. Uh, let's call from LeBlanc's yellow phone. Uh, let's call Kawakami when you're free and invite her to meet you at your room. Well. Okay, I have to go. Bye, teacher. Uh, WTF, the game just teleported me here. Hi, friend. Hi, friend. How you doing? How you doing? Oh, wait, I want to talk to you. Hi. Hi. What you reading? What are you reading? Wait, that's the... Wrong person. <laughs> Makoto! Oh. Uh, er, er, you're still here? Uh, what have Sakamoto-kun and, and Takamaki-san been uh, saying about that shocking Madawame case? Oh, um, never mind. I was just simply curious. Okay, Makoto, you have a, you have a good day. Whoa. Breaking Bad. Oh my goodness. Why is everything a Breaking Bad reference? Why has this become JoJo's? Is she gonna follow me downstairs? Or is it just the second floor? Isn't she supposed to be a third year? Pretty sure her and Haru are- Oh, yeah, there she is. <laughs> Pretty sure her and Haru are uh, third years, so... Right, yeah, she's reading Chainsaw Man. I forgot about that. Now, here's the thing about Kawakami. I don't want to do her social link. But, apparently her social link has, like, good, like, good things come from it. Incredible. Incredible. Pretty sure that has nothing of use to me. Haven't watched Breaking Bad in a while. <laughs> I haven't watched Breaking Bad at all. Not since the last time I have. The problem with it is that they're, like, hour-long episodes, so I have to... I have to really prepare for it. Ooh, how's my health, you ask? How's your health? I'm all prepped and ready for your clinical trial. If you come now, you won't have to wait. Uh, yes. Wait, should I have done something else? It's fine. This... This... Needs, like, immediate... I need to be here immediately. Well, hold on, okay, I'll... I'll Her clock is broken. Uh, let me th think. Okay, what is there anything else I have to do first? Speaking of Breaking Bad, have you seen the new Breaking Bad animation? The one in Bakist- <laughs> What? Breaking Bad animation? Is- is it like an official thing? Is this like Slipping Jimmy or what? what is this? Anyways, I don't think I ha actually- I'm just trying to remember if there's any, like... That's right, um... Okay, well, I wanted to go to the one place. It's a fan animation. Oh, okay. In that case, probably not. Uh, well... I guess the answer would have been no anyways, because I haven't heard of anything about this. Um... What I want to try to do... Also, sorry, sorry, uh, I, I, sorry, I just left <laughs> all of a sudden with no explanation. Uh, okay. His name is Xanax. Interesting. What I wanted to do is I wanted to go to Kichi Joji, right? Uh, and, uh, cause I know the, the whole thing with like the mementos thing, right? Where I got to look for the guy's name. So I got to ask around and also I want to see all the shops and stuff. So I'm going to go ahead and go here. Uh, I forget what- I'll just go here. Oh my goodness. 
I mean, it's relatively cheap, I gotta say, so... Yeah, we'll go listen around to what people say. I, I forget what the, uh, the... I'm supposed to be looking for, but... I wanna be strong like Featherman, I want some imported protein! I- I see, but you can also become strong by eating your mom's cooking, you know? <gasps> but mom's cooking won't turn me into Featherman, I wanna be like Featherman! Okay. I also gotta see which of these is actual shops. I think, uh, this one. Crystal Healing. Stone On! That's an awesome name. Uh, welcome. Please take a look at what we have. Welcome! Oh, it's one of these. Black rock. <laughs> so it's just a rock. Oh my goodness. Atom necklace? Hold on. A necklace that looks like a ring of atoms. Cool. Okay. Well, that's interesting. I love that everyone's walking around with... Uh, little, little thingies, little umbrellas. I wish it would be... Like, this place looks cool. A cycling shop? Uh, what, can I buy a piano? Hold on. Uh, just had the raid. Uh, uh, just had the raid. Uh. Oh, this is a jazz place. What happens if I click on here? Okay, I guess I can't go there yet. Pretty sure that's where um, you hang out with in Akechi's thing. Speaking of which, oh, we still haven't seen him. We still haven't seen him. <laughs> Welcome, please. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Welcome. This is just health. Okay, wait, that's good health, though. Ooh. To all out. Okay. I gotta have at least one. At least one. Come on, that's good. That's good. I gotta, I gotta have one. To so all allies as well? Yeah. That's good. I'm supposed to be asking around for, for the, for the guy. Uh... What? Oh, cause I'm... Okay. Hey, welcome! We're selling a, our hot fresh Chinese pots here! This is all just HP items! Let's see, I want to go... Yes, 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 please, please stop me. Please stop me from playing the game. Thank you. Uh... Oh! Oh, wait, 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 okay, it actually had a thing. I, I took one look and was like, no, nah, there's nothing there. All right. Oh, yeah, yeah, I remember. I already got all that, actually. Um, oh, wait, I gotta go here for this, apparently. Don't, I, I'm literally about to go, oh, wait, oh, there's a roof. Oh, I didn't know that. Give me food. <sighs> All right. <laughs> Clothing store. Let me guess. Armor, huh? Oh, uh, at the secondhand shop, you can sell city armor you own. Depending on what the city armor was originally, it may fetch a decent price. Uh, for each clothing item you sell, you will obtain shop points, which can be traded for prices at the shop. Okay. Nice. I've been here for 40 years, but I've never seen clothing that makes my heart chill. Alright, I'll buy it, but I'll only buy it for the price it deserves. So we have a point card system here. Each piece of clothing you sell here will give you 10 points. Once you obtain enough points, you can trade them for a prize. So feel free to let us take the clothing off your hands. Okay, well, let me do it then. Let me sell. Oh my goodness, it has its own- Oh my- Wow! It's got all the people! Look at that! I saw Jack Frost in the background. And then there's the, there's the one lady, there's the guy with the sword. Uh, and there's the demon guy with the big, long, hard thing on him. And there's Jack Frost. That's cool looking. <laughs> uh, should I go ahead and do this? I mean... <coughs> Supposedly, you know, I'll go ahead and check. 
Let me out of here. Let me out of here. That's unreasonably high amount you've collected. <laughs> it sure is. Okay. I want to go, uh, equipment. I just want to make sure the th things, wait. Yeah, 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 uh, protector. The things that they are wearing are like the best thing that they have. So that anything that I... Oh, wait, oh. This is the one that's equipped, but then this is... Okay, well, let me go ahead and do that then. That's the one. Okay. Yeah. I just want to make sure that, that we have like the best w that we have on. You can have Kawakami clean them for you. I'll come back later. <laughs> uh, okay then, cool. And this is a, a, a VHS store or something? What is this? It says three on the, on the thing there. Hello and welcome, we have plenty of items here. Okay. Ah, these things. Okay, well, hold on. For the art enthusiast, I think I know who might like that. For the discerning eye, okay. For the gentleman. Okay, that has to be Sojuro, right? But it's also expensive, so I'm not gonna... Okay, I just want to see the guy. Uh, I want to... Whoa, okay. That, that... What are you talking about? I called Inokashira Park Inoko uh, the other day, and the guy was like, where's that? Seriously, I thought Inoko was a popular abb abbreviation. Does that guy even know the official name? He's got to know that. Inakashira Ancho Park. It's like super famous. Well, even you got it wrong. <laughs> Whatever. You guys are nerds, and you're also not talking about the thing I need. Wait, there's a velvet room here? Hmm? Oh, yeah, there's a, there's a velvet room. I didn't even know. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Let's see. I'm just gonna go to all the places where there's a, a speech bubble. You can now quick travel to the temple of Gage Doji. Oh, what brings you here, young man? Oh my, I see a tense emotions rolling in your eyes. Passion is not always dangerous only if one knows how to claim one's heart oh i know how to do that why don't you spend some time in solitude here maybe you will attain enlightenment and the peace hmm. claim one's heart does he mean you can meditate here if you meditate at the temple you will be able to increase your maximum sp however time will pass oh okay the more you meditate the greater the effect will be check your schedule and use the temple diligently Cool. What do you do? I'm good. Cause I wanna find out where the one guy is. What is that by the way? Okay, well. That takes so long, that's so annoying. It's a fun detail, but uh, it, I don't like it. There's literally nobody over there. Yeah. Is it just that nobody shows up in the rain? In that case, coming here might have been a waste of time. E. I think it was. I think I wasted two, two, 200 yen coming here. Because what I'm looking for, because remember, uh, the one nerd guy that no one likes, he mentioned something like, oh yeah, if you go go around the Kijijoji and, and, um, ask around for the, for, to look for the target. But it might just be that there's nobody to talk to because it's raining, or something like that. I'll look around just a little bit more, just in case I'm wrong, but... 
Do I have to ask you about it? Hey, any questions? Uh. Come again. I don't know. Okay, how do I look for uh request? Is that it? Okay. Uh, what? Okay, right. These are ID'd. Wait, one. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember that one. An elderly meaning of life. I think that's the one. That Mishima told you about an old man causing trouble. Ask around for info in Kichijoji at night. Oh, at night. Well, it's close to night. I mean, uh. That's annoying. I. Whatever. You know what? I mean, I did, like, buy a thing. You know what? Some of my armor's clean. I, I did clean it in, like, the, the laundry. So let me... Will it, like, tell me... Oh, wait, no, that's right. The, the, the sooty armor means it's dirty, doesn't it? And then you clean it, and then it becomes a different one. Ah, uh, so maybe not... Oh my goodness! Wait, yeah, I didn't even realize that. How do I have so many? I have 98, 72, 51, 89. Oh my goodness. Uh. Uh. No returns except we'll have to sell. I kind of want to sell these. <laughs> Just to see. You know what? Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna save real quick. Just, uh, just in case this is a bad decision. I'll go ahead and save here. Okay. <sighs> Welcome. I want to go ahead and sell all of them. <laughs> that, oh, that's gonna reach uh, two mil. Oh, so close. Three hundred and twenty-one pieces of clothing, and I've got three thousand twenty-one points. <laughs> uh, let me see the prizes. Oh my goodness, these are okay. Cleansing air freshener cures all non-special ailments for one party. Okay, that might... Wait. Oh, for one ally. I don't know why I said party. Fast-acting disinfectant lowers accuracy evasion for... Okay. Uh, the belt of swift-footed... Of a swift-footed god. So I guess it just makes you faster. <laughs> Contains four sets... Of used clothes, what you get is a surprise. Oh, so that's a so that's a mystery bag right there. I'll go ahead and get four of these. Uh, five, because those seem useful. And I'll go ahead and get a few of these. I feel like this might be good to have as well. And, uh, we'll get one of these, just because I'm curious. Hey, hey. Alright, let's take a look. Oh, I didn't even, I didn't even... Not too bad, let's get this again some time. Okay. That's a weird idea for a store, though. You have to, like... You have to sell things in order to actually buy them. Anyways, I guess we'll go ahead and go back. And we'll do... Your whole thing. And then I'll come back here at night. Or whatever. What's up, GF? Let's do this thing. It feels like a day off because I don't have very many patients today. But it's raining, so I may get an influx of people with colds. You came because you saw my message, right? I wanna do a clothes. 
In that case, my little guinea pig, here's something I want to test out today. Yep. Uh, actually, decline. Because... I want to buy something. I want to see what she has for sale, because I, I, I forget what she has. Or if she's got anything, like, new or something. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I developed the ultimate drug! Uh, I really do love the whole, like, chemical reactions going on in the background. So cool. Um... Wait. Oh, okay. She's breaking bad. I feel like we're gonna say that a lot with <laughs> hearing her confidant. Uh. <laughs> I hate some of these names. No har M. Recov R. Revivadrin. No, oh, that one's cool. Uh, that one. I'll take like two of those. Rejuvenating. That should work. I'll take three of those. Take care. Okay. Now we're gonna have we're gonna go on a date with our hot uh, goth GF. Don't ask. Why would you ask me? Oh, are you gonna hang? Out? Yes, I'm gonna hang out with her. He's head to the exam room. <laughs> okay, that's all for today. If you're feeling okay, you can go home now. I never pointed this out. I like how the poster of the bear has like a, a syringe going through its eye. Hello, Dr. Takemi's Clinic of Infernal Medicine. What? Again? What? That's... Well, that ship's already sailed, so... <laughs> See, look at the bear. Ah, what a pain. What? You remember that girl from the other day? The chief of staff, o Omada, Oyamada's patient? Her dad's been bringing her here to be treated, even though I referred to them to another hospital. I even made them... I even told them about the medical error I made. Uh... Let's see, they trust you, or was it really your fault? I feel like she'll get defensive about this. I'll say, they trust you. I'm just a quack, though. Alright, then. <laughs> the medical error was well documented. Everyone in my field knows about it. I led the development of a new drug for an incurable illness called Clough Crawford Endes disease. Although I wasn't the one who administrated the drug, it was the cause of the error. <laughs> With Crawford and Endes, what uh, Crawford ends certain spells, cells indiscriminately attacked other cells throughout the body. When it reaches the muscles, the patient slowly begins to die. There hasn't been much progress made on it, partially because there haven't been many cases of it. I worked with a pharmaceutical company that had reached the final stage of production, but one day I was suddenly removed from my position. That chief of staff, Oyamada, my superior at the time, took over the entire operation. Uh, I don't know if he wanted the glory of developing a new drug or to become rich and famous, but he made careless mistakes and rushed com completion so he could use it on a patient named Miwa. Miwa-chan had a re reaction and lapsed into critical condition. The chief panicked and laid the blame on me. Miwa-chan and her family resented me. No matter what I said, I couldn't change how they felt about me. Uh, I had no idea. That's fine. Well, that's fine, I guess. The development of the medicine was suspended, so I had no reason to stay at that hospital. 
At least now I can keep working as a general practitioner on my own terms with my guinea pig. That's the new medicine I've been trying out on you. This version is in final, the final stage of testing. It searches for those cells that take the offensive and destroys them upon detection. That's why it's harmless for people who don't have the disease. Probably. <laughs> Probably? Uh... I'll say that's good. <laughs> oh, three stars! You have a lot of faith in me. Thank you, my little guinea pig. Hey. You'd better not flank on me this late in the game. I'm inching closer to the finish line, but I need your help to reach it. In exchange, I can offer you medicine at a special price. I'm counting on you, guinea pig. Well, it's cool that I just bought the medicine before the discount. <laughs> it feels like my bomb to come is growing even deeper. Nice. Rank five. We're halfway through it. Immunization. Add support items to the inventory at the clinic. Yeah, it's cool that I, I just bought everything <laughs> before that. I should have thought about that. Now, what should I do about the girl, that girl and her dad? I mean, uh, being mean and scaring them hasn't worked. It's been a while since I've had to deal with this kind of nuisance. It's stressing me out. Oh, sorry. That's all I wanted to talk to you about. You can go home now. I feel like cooperating in that shady clinical trial has increased my guts. Cool. Is it really shady though? If we 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 pretty much know her pretty well. I, it's not even it's not that shady. Run away, well, well. What? Okay, I see. I thought he was in front of the clinic. I was like, why did you take out an umbrella and put it back in? You doing okay, my little guinea pig? Just wanted to check up on you. Also, sorry for the long talk today. I wasn't planning on telling you all that. Uh... Oh, gonna, I, w w which one matters? I mean... I assume she feels the most strongly about this one. So I'll say that. Yeah. You okay, whatever. You're the first person I, I've really shared all that with. But it was a, also a good reminder that this is something I have to do as the plague. Thanks to you, the drug's development is progressing very smoothly. If there was no issues with the latest sample, I think we're on the edge of- they're right on the edge of finally finishing it. Oh, sorry. Looks like I've got a patient. Maybe that girl and her dad came back. I gotta go. See you later. <laughs> She's cool. <laughs> okay, now I gotta go talk around to people. I gotta go waste more money on a train ticket. Here we go. Oh my- what? You have anything for the zoo? Pros will have you. Uh, Miss Arsut uh, must be busy uh, doing something. Uh, you don't have to be so harsh. What was you supposed to The one I was supposed to be gonna keep me tabs on us. I think she's suspicious of us. Are you sure it's not merely the result of the million contacts? Shut up! I'm, kind of, I'm going through it. I want to go to Kichishoji. I must be honest, the three of you most certainly stand out. Do try to be careful. I can't be there to look over you, you at school, you know. That truly rests on your broad shoulders, Makira. Yeah, cause you would have been of any help, surely. Don't worry. I'll be sure to keep an eye on Ryuji too. Why do you guys single me out? The others kinda overshadow you sometimes, but don't forget. You're famous too. Am I? Just make sure you're careful, okay? <laughs> okay. Wait, I'm a famous too. Me the play What? <laughs> Huh? <laughs> what? <laughs> How did you get this number? Karen Lane, that's not a su sufficient explanation. Inmate, come to the entrance of the Velvet Room before we change our minds. 
That's the door uh, only we can see in your that's the door only we can see in your world. Oh, that is what she said. You better not go to the wrong place. Then we will be waiting for you. We expect great haste and enthusiasm from you. Since when they, could they call me? I don't remember that. Who are you talking about? They sound really noisy. If you've been summoned somewhere, you should probably get going. Yeah, I'm gonna go without you, by the way. Uh, wait, what's the uh, thing? Literally not gonna talk to you. Alright, not even gonna look. Not even gonna leave you on red. Okay, well, you know what? There is a velvet room in Keiichi Joji, so... Let's do this. Let's waste more money. It's only 200. It's fine. I'll make that back uh, in a day of doing the whatever job that I have. Which is also at night. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. So now we can do that. It's not going to be... Well, I guess it stopped raining. Let's see. I forget which one's Harmony Alley. Uh, okay, this place is... Yeah, it's a lot busier at night. Okay. I'm not sure what all this is about. It's not raining, so... Okay. That guy looks cool. Let's see. I'm just... I'm looking specifically for speech bubbles. And yeah, and then there's those two. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. don't change the camera angle on me like that. See you later. Well, see you later. Okay, nothing there. Oh, this must be Harmony Alley then. There we go, there's some people talking. Hmm? <laughs> that guy looks cool. Uh, everyone's talking about Madurame, I guess, but I guess there's, that's no surprise given how well known he is. Ugh, he ain't a real artist, just a skeevy lion pig acting like a person of culture. Well, art and culture are fine and all, but in the end, we're all human. More er, morality aside, money is important. I understand how it can become a person's top priority. Seriously, I can't believe what I'm hearing. Money ain't everything. Well, that was important. I wonder if this pacing gonna cut it to reach a catchy event. I suppose not. Whoops. Okay, I guess maybe... See, I don't know what all this... I don't... I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Who am I talking to? Examine. Uh, alcohol, that's cool. You guys talk? Nope, you're not even real. Can I talk to you? Nope. You got a talking thing. Let me talk to you. Uh, da 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 da. Okay. Where have you been? I just want to get some information on the case, man. I don't think looking at the bar is gonna do anything. Uh, there was a guy here. Can I talk to you? Oh, wait. I don't think it's him. Yeah, yeah okay. Uh, oh, wait, you're talking. That old man hasn't come here yet. No wonder I'm drinking in peace. Uh, I don't like badmouthing my customers, but he makes so much trouble. An old man making trouble? Hey, do you, um, yeah, probably. Uh, hey, uh, this ain't the place for a youngin like you. You looking for something around here? The elderly troublemaker. Oh boy, so even kids like you know about him. That old man's out of control. He takes... Dr I'm not even gonna do a voice. He a consistent voice. He takes drink... That old man's out of control. He takes drinks from strangers, he starts fights, and when you, he gets in trouble, he causes a ruckus and tries to mooch money off people. <gasps> That's creep. What's creepy is the more trouble he makes, the wider his smile gets. Got a name. Oh yeah, the old man's always shouting his name over and over. 
Heiji Ono, right? Yep, that's the name. Okay. All right, we got a name of our culprit. But you know, I can't be that hard on him. He's around my dad's age. Oh, wait, that's the aproned man. That's what that says. When he complains about his joints hurting on rainy days, I can't help but feel sorry for the old man. I wish he didn't hang around here, but stayed warm with his family inside. You know, uh, uh, y you might sound awfully s sympathetic, but I know you, you really think he's a pain in, in the area. Yeah, well, I'm not denying that. Mm. These guys seem like like nice, nice guys. Seem like nice, friendly guys. His joints hurt on rainy days. Poor guy. Um, yeah. Okay, cool. So we can go bully that guy into submission. All right, and now I go over to the velvet room. What to send me? Yo. Okay. <laughs> a little delayed there. That's fine. You cut off the music. Alright, what do you want? Uh, yes. Did you need something? Uh... Oh, is that what they're referring to? Wait, I don't... I'll check on this. Okay. We're looking for- okay, that's just this thing. Okay, whatever. A special battle, is that- well, Okay, we're just doing this then, alright. A new mode has been unlocked for ch challenge battles. A new mode- <laughs> okay. Oh, oh, cause this is the, uh, yeah, the, I have the DLCs for this. Okay. Oh. <laughs> hey, wait, that's Jack Frost. An entry-level mode that tests combat fundamentals, including striking weaknesses, supports, and baton passing. Wait, let me go back. Can I save here? How am I saving? I don't- I have my hands in chains. I'll go ahead and save over what I had. I think it's fine that I sold all that stuff. Something. Okay. Cool. So... For level 10. Oh, so do I have to be at least level 10 for that? And then... Okay, goodness, that jumped up quickly. Wait, let me... Okay. An entry-level mode that tests combat fundamentals, including striking weaknesses, supports, and baton passing. Okay. Oh, what is it called? That's called Trial. Chain. Uh, a mo oh, I like how all the other ones are all, like, a different color now, because they're not the focal point. A mode where you identify enemy weaknesses and chain baton passes to achieve a high score. Interesting. Okay, yeah, so I'm not good enough for this yet. Um, technical and advanced mode. Okay, so I guess these are all just, like, to help you with certain things, but I what I want to see... Uh, an expert mode in which you aim for a high score by surviving. Okay. Who is this, by the way? It's just recommended level. Ah, uh, okay. Right, that makes sense. Okay. Uh, Trickster. A mode that... That's Alice. Right. Okay, I know who this is, but I forget who is... This. Who, where is Alice from? Is she from the... Is she from Shin Megami Tensei? Or is it from one of the other Persona games? I don't remember. Yes, okay. SMT. I'm assuming this guy's from SMT as well. I feel- isn't that the old design for Loki? <laughs> you can see Jack Frost in the background. Oh look, speaking of background, look at the, the, the backdrop. It's got a whole like, big cage there. That ain't Loki? Oh, okay. Nah, I forget. <laughs> I don't know these things. I mean, it said trickster, so I thought, wait, is that Loki? A mode that will test masters of all elements. Okay. Here we go. Look, it's the Persona 3 remake. That's the same model, isn't it? And yeah, it's a, the... 
<laughs> the explanation for this is weird as well. A full, a special battle against the cognitive echo of a certain Persona user who fought to prevent the fall of humanity. So I'm, some I'm fighting... Just like lines and lines of skull of I'm fighting an echo, apparently. And then we have that one. I like how they're both like not facing the camera as if we can't tell who they are. Who dispelled a strange otherworldly fog. Oh yeah, put the skull emojis for this guy, right? Uh, not this guy though, he's still... Okay, cool. But is that what they wanted to talk to me about, or is it a different thing? Did I talk to you? No. Done already? What? I don't know, you wanted to talk to me about something. Persona 4 Remaster. I almost feel like they're not gonna do that just because I feel like Golden is good as is, like... Persona 3 had, like, room for improvements, especially in, like, the visual department, I feel. But... I feel like Golden is, like, already, like, kind of at the standard that Atlas has set themselves at. Like, it's already, you know... The UI design is already all stylish and all that, so... I don't feel like they ever will do a remaster of it. Do you need something? Okay, I guess not, because I picked on both things. Let's do it. So I, I guess that's all that they wanted. It is time, inmate. Yeah, I don't know. Oh my goodness. Right, let me just make sure, it, it... Let's just talk to her one last time. You're late, next time we expect you in front of us within two seconds of our calling. Oh, okay, wait, no, this is what it was. Let's call them special assignments. To the point, there are a number of places in your reality society that may foster your rehabilitation. You will... Prove the value of these places to us in person. Oh, so is this where I do the actual, like, social link stuff with them? Uh, we... <laughs> we will select, uh, various locations that we suspect could be vital to your rehabilitation. Should you recognize the place that we mentioned, then you are to escort us there. Uh, you wanna go explore? <laughs> Are those ears of yours just for decoration? Those are- these are spe- uh, I can't. I can't. These are special assignments for the sake of your rehabilitation. Work- hey, yo, yo. Uh, based? Work just as hard at them as you do the rest of your duties. We will await you in front of the door, like this, whenever a special assignment is available. Okay. Uh, should you meet our expectations, we'll scrape together some sort of reward for you, so no slacking off. We ought to mention these special assignments will not be available indefinitely. To phrase it for your comprehension, you will have until the end of the year to complete them. Alright, so, like, everything else in the game, okay. You are also required to continue working towards your rehabilitation to earn these assignments. We're... We're really going out of our way for you here. Uh, don't tell us we never did anything special for you. You can... <sighs> this is too much reading, man. You can now take the twins to various facilities that, uh, pique their interest. Blah, 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 blah. I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it. It's a social link, I get it. That concludes our explanation. Uh, we will now introduce the first special whatever. I am prepared! I am prepared! Go ahead. Very well. Then listen closely. The first location we have chosen is... Is... One that has grown quite popular lately. It's per... Pur purported to offer foods that stimulate the feeling of being in space. Oh, so Big Bang Burger. 
The food is apparently massive enough to rival the size of the universe itself and resembles a mysterious spacecraft. If this... <laughs> so much to read! If this food exemplifies both the unknown and the vast nothingness of space, I'm sure it will stimulate the heart. Does this description bring any locations to mind? Sure does. Well, if you know where it is, then escort us there immediately. Why'd she say spaghetti? That's so weird. She must be a Pizza Tower fan. Yeah, I'm not stupid. I know where that is. So what do you do? You mean, I'd rather not. I'd rather not do this right now. Uh, the Big Bang Burger. The name is fitting, I suppose. We shall confirm our intel for ourselves. Lead the way. Well, I mean, I have to actually be there first. I hope you're paying for my ticket. Oh, okay. I, I guess I guess they did. Well, it is indeed shaped like a, a mysterious craft, but it's much smaller than I had expect. Oh wait, that's the other. It's much smaller than I had expected. Is this the meal they bo boasted to be as immense as the cosmos? I'm quite disappointed. Hey, inmate. Uh, you don't really expect some kind of reward out of us, do you? Uh... Wait, what? I don't know. I, I Wait, I don't get the question. Uh, reward out of eating the burger? Or taking them here? I, they're underwhelmed. Yeah, I get that. Is So... I was gonna say this is just the beginning? What? What? Then what's the main event look like? Stop wasting our time and tell us. Oh, so they they get they can get that large? <laughs> the Big Bang Challenge. What an intriguing concept. For the sake of your rehabilitation, you are to take this challenge. <laughs> of course you will take the largest they offer. Any objections, inmate? Uh I'm not ranked high enough. Okay. Ah, yes, I did overhear that the challenge requires advancement through required advancement through a number of previous stages. Quit spacing out. Uh, I don't care. You're taking the challenge one way or another. Get on your knees and beg if you have to. Okay. There it is. <laughs> Thank you for waiting. Don't tell me. You, you're really doing this. Not only that, but you're our 10,000th customer. To show our appreciation, we're treating you with the highest tier of the Big Bang Challenge, the Cosmic Tower Burger. Is that even possible to eat IRL? Yeah. I mean, it'd take you a few days, but yeah, you can eat that. <laughs> You'd have to like slice it up and eat it over the course of a week. Oh, wow, lucky you. Uh, well then, it's time to take the, uh, start the 30 minute Big Bang Challenge started. Ready? Begin! <laughs> that last burger was downright insignificant by comparison. It's bigger than the inmate's entire stomach. Perhaps the, the mo moniker, that moniker implies, what is this music? <laughs> this is a cool beat, actually. This, <laughs> this sounds like it's from the, the SMT games. Okay. Uh, implies that any di diner's stomach will s suffer its own big bang. I'll definitely pop. Uh, uh, would you care to try it? <laughs> this is your rehabilitation, not ours. That's right. Uh, we are here only to observe you, and don't forget it. I predict this challenge shall be a fairly difficult one. Be that it may, you might finish the food tower in its entirety. F failing to join the clean plate club is a grave offense. She really just made a pizza tower reference. She said food tower. Okay. Do you think it's a good idea to add even more crimes to your record? Get to the rehabilitating, inmate. This <laughs> looks stupid. That doesn't look like that should work. 
He's not even holding it. His hands aren't even touching the model. Um. <laughs> I was gonna say this better rank up my things if if we're actually just gonna spend time here. Not a bad start, but you're only just begun. I'm already full. <laughs> you're you're stopping. Uh, who said you could stop? No breaks. Work that jaw. Work that sucker to death. Come on now. Uh, Herm, uh, don't uh, don't his eyes look rather dead to you? Perhaps he is glimpsing the vast emptiness of outer space. Uh, hey, is he really all right? He's not about to kneel over, is he? Or keel over? I don't think I can finish this. I, I think he's about to pass out. It appears this truly was too much for him to handle. Very well, let us pitch in. Hey. Uh, you're hopeless, inmate. You'd better be grateful that we're baiting you out of this. Cool. <laughs> he does look dead inside. Wait, whose bag is that? That's not Joker's bag. Where's Morgana? We just left him in Kichijoji, I guess. He's like, huh, the Joker just left with like two toddlers dressed in police outfits, so I hope he's alright. Uh, a few, we did it. I have to say, you really held your own there. Uh, you almost didn't make it though, but we'll call this a success since your stomach didn't burst. Uh, I must say though, I'm rather dissatisfied with this place's usage of the moniker Big Bang Burger. D I skipped a thing! No, wait, how do I do the log? There we go. Uh... They certainly craft a meal of... They certainly craft a meal of impressive size, but when compared to that of the Big Bang... That the... Of what the Big Bang generated, it's not grand in the least. Do humans really... Ha do humans have some sort of compulsion for exaggerating the size of things? Good question. In fact, this challenge raises quite a few of them. You took the challenge for the sake of your rehabilitation, but who in their right mind would willingly consume so much food? Uh, maybe I didn't understand humanity. Maybe I don't understand humanity at all. Say, inmate, why are humans always testing and pushing their limits? Uh, that's not an answer. Uh, they do it as a sort of training. Aren't there more practical approaches to training than such behavior? Hey, Justine, maybe we should take the challenge ourselves. I just had the very same thought. If we were to thrust ourselves into this ordeal, perhaps we would discover some answers. They're just gonna order- Hey, person! Uh, how can I help you? We're taking the Big Bang Challenge. You already kind of did that, though. <sighs> Well, uh, there's a minimum age requirement for the- Ooh. Oh, so y'all actually cheated. Oh, could I interest you in our little bang meal instead? It even comes with a toy. Don't you want a cute little spaceship? A spaceship? That's a burger, fries, and a juice for 500 yen. Uh, it'll be right up. <laughs> cool. Wait, we didn't ask for- It's too late now. Let's just settle f for that today. I admit I'm intrigued by the dis diminutive spaceship. <laughs> they really are just children. <laughs> Employees Kobeni. Ah, you're right. Well, Hold on, I gotta readjust my things. The wonders of space, but at least the taste was passable. Oh, there was a voice. I didn't even notice. Yeah, it's kind of weird of Igor. He literally just hired children to be his employees. <laughs> there should be some sort of, uh, some sort of, uh, like, intergalactic, interrealm. I don't know what. There should be some a law about that in the realm that Igor resides in. Uh, well. <laughs> we it did, didn't experience any of the wonders of space, but at least the taste was passable. You seemed much more excited you... by the toy than the taste, anyway. Sh shut up! I saw you eating around those pickle things or whatever they are, Justine. 
Oh, right. Her name's Justine, not Justine. That, that wasn't food from this earth. It was clearly a alien spawn of some sort. What? Is this true? I don't get the hate for pickles. I love pickles, especially on my burgers. <laughs> They're a delicacy. <laughs> exactly. I see. Well, they didn't taste bad. Oh, wait, did that give me three? I'm still got a voice dialogue after Red Faster. What? Yeah. But seriously, what are they? I ate all of mine, you know. Calm down, Caroline. We're getting off track. <clears throat> well, at any rate, we've determined that hamburgers are incapable of conveying the majesty of space. While the toy spaceship helped to soften the blow, there's no denying the truth. Now we will formally acknowledge the completion of your task. Here is your reward. Please be money. Okay. No, okay. Well, I mean that made it a little better. Just as hard next time. We know about all sorts of locations that would aid your rehabilitation. I'm still taken aback by the truth. Your world is absolutely full of these shop places. For a reasonable fee, nearly every desire can be fulfilled. All as if it were nothing. That does sound interesting. I believe it may merit further research. Anyways, good work, inmate. Your final task for the day is to escort us back to the velvet room. Let's move. Cool. Well, that was... <laughs> I can't... <laughs> I love these comments. They can't catch everyone. Can't believe I, I once ta talked like Velvet Room Attendant back then. <laughs> yeah. Listen up, inmate! Anyways. Oh, okay. I, I, I literally just saw this. Pixar, it didn't happen. Shut up, Morgan. Now for today's hair news, AZ Lazar, calling card at Monorama Exhibit. The, yeah, I already know about this, dude. Students getting scammed, that's scary. You should be careful when you go to Shibuya. Yeah, I'm kind of the Joker baby, so I don't really need to worry about that. Okay, so this is a whole thing. What's this? A request to the student body. It says they're looking for information. I heard Principal Kobayakawa put it up. Please consult the student council president if you have any details. So we can go to her for anything? <laughs> this voice sounds silly. I don't know why. Why the student council president, though? Why the student council Principal Kobayakawa. <laughs> I mean, Nijima-san is his favorite. Maybe that's why he asked her to do it. Cool. How tragic. Oh, it seems like most of society was surprised about what that artist did. He was someone who represented Japan, who they truly trusted him based on his name alone. Indeed, uh, we we are easily manipulated by the names we see. However, this world is filled with fake names. For instance, this creature, which you know well. It's called the Red Crab King, but it was but it has a form that a crab should not have. Kurosef Kun, look at this picture. What picture? Okay. Give it a try. Give it a try. The Red King Crab is biologically related to the Hermit Crab. So, how is it different from a crab? Do you know? Uh... What? Red King Crab is biologically related to the Hermit Crab, so how is it different from a crab? Uh... What? I mean, I think crabs normally have that many legs. It's the legs, really? I mean, I'll go with it. 
That's it. Really? I thought all crabs had like three legs. Oh, maybe they have eight, actually. I, I don't know. <gasps> Let's go back. Ah, oh, okay, okay, that's where, yeah, that's where I got it messed up. Crabs have five pairs of legs. Wait, five? Mother King only has four pairs. Oh, it's counting the, uh, yeah, okay, I see, I see. The direction the legs unfold is reversed too. Typically they face forward, but the king, the red kings do not. Sheesh! Oh, whoops, I, I had it on audio, I didn't even know. Oh, you must have been really smart to answer that question. Yeah, I definitely didn't just cheat. Ah, oh, come on, I, I gotta level up sometime soon. Incidentally, the Tom Alley, the, t the tamale of a crab isn't its brain, it's as some people say. It's actually the crab's liver and pancreas. Got in a Bam Bam reference. As you can see, the world is full of deception. I saw some kind of plate, uh, paste like that in the fridge at LeBlanc. Uh, yeah. <laughs> whatever, cat. Whatever, Morgan. What? Okay, we're still in class, I guess. Our name did spread a bit, thanks about around me. But I, I bet people would still wouldn't care if we came out and said we're the Phantom Thieves. <laughs> Let's try it. I'm sure nothing will go wrong. Please don't. That may seem like a fun idea for now. But what good would come of telling people our identities? Maybe they'll at least start treating us with some respect. Well, I can understand why you feel that way. That's how, just how things are now. But if we keep doing stuff like this, that will definitely change. Just like life. <laughs> uh, we simply need to devote ourselves to the cause. Our praise will come later. What he said! Does a little finger emoji that points up. Uh, I'm, I'm sure some people out there will understand. Uh, I guess we just gotta act like modest heroes for now. Okay, Ryuji. Okay, we doing this again? Ugh, I don't care. I just want to save my game. Take your time. You're taking my time. Who are you? I don't know your names. Oh, okay. President, what is the meaning of that posting? Principal Kobayakawa put that up without my. I'm gonna put it on auto, by the way. Okay, uh, I guess not. I guess I'll press forward <laughs> by myself. <laughs> I guess that's what auto means. <laughs> I heard some students are getting threatened. I'm so scared. Please do something. <laughs> Why'd she read it like that? <laughs> they have dirt on me and they're demanding money. I can't go to the police. What should I do? Isn't this talking about the crimes that have been rumored to be occurring in Shibuya? So there are even victims at our school. What should we do? This isn't the responsibility of the student council. How does the student council only have three members, by the way? Principal Kobayakawa called you in yesterday, right? Did he tell you anything about this? Well, no. He's out today, but I will ask him tomorrow. Please wait on this for the time being. If you say so. It is as a. My apologies for the confusion. Don't worry. I'll do something about all of this. Is that Yosuke from P4? Was that the voice? Buh, 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 buh. What? Okay, don't be Mishima. Oh my! Okay, actually I should. Wanna hear- uh, da, da, da. It's just another case, I guess. We can't lump- uh, uh, No way. Oh, I I still have an auto. Yeah, whatever, Mishima. Don't even care. Okay. Uh, what I'm gonna go ahead and do is uh, what am I gonna do? I should write something. I should write something. Yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. 
Where's the, where, 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 come on, where, where is she? Where is she? Where is she at? I know she's here. I know she's here. Come on, friend. Where are you? Uh, uh, oh, is she not here? Oh, okay. I guess she didn't feel like spying on me today. Anyways, uh, yeah, okay. What I want to do is I want to go ahead. Let's see. Do I have any things? Probably not. No, uh, confidants, I mean. Uh, since it's raining, I'll go ahead and go to Shibuya, and I'll go to the one area, the diner. Just because it'll improve my knowledge more. Yeah, 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 whatever, dude. Let's go in. It'll also improve my guts a slight bit, so that's why I like- I like studying here. Because I can at least do that. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, oh yeah, I can do guts, but then I can also do kindness. Should I start focusing on kindness? Don't- um, it, which one's the one that I have at rank 3? I forget. It's the one in the bottom right. I'll go ahead and do guts, just because I want to- do gun guys thing as soon as possible. I need it at rank three, so. Groan, I know, you're a stupid cat. I know, we all know. For real? I got guts for real? It was proficiency. I guess I should focus a little bit on kindness. <laughs> oh, look at that. Rank three, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Oh yeah, that feels good. <laughs> All right. Finally, something else that isn't proficiency. Head back? Now it looks somewhat balanced. The star does. <sighs> See, that was a good decision. Ah, you're, you're back. back. Hey. So that probably mean let me <laughs> I'm so sorry I want to go in here because I want to see um, I'm gonna think I just want to see uh, okay I know idea how far well it's because I just did it somewhat close to improving charm okay definitely close to improving guts okay so I'm almost there Somewhat close kindness. Okay. Oh my goodness. That's all I need to know. Um. Yeah, it seems like we're getting close to the plot stuff. I'm going to go ahead and read and finish up this last book. It's not like I need to do it now. I just wanted to go ahead and do it. Tobacco pipe. Wow. All right, we're talking about Galmon. Go away, Mon. Go away, Mon. Oh, I got three? What? <laughs> okay, we raked up our guts. Cool. <laughs> That's exactly what I wanted. I'm staunch now. Alright, and it's probably gonna do more plot stuff. After that, I'll save and then we'll end it off. Yeah, that was a good thing I did all that. <laughs> Cause yeah, isn't it on the 9th when, uh, something's supposed to happen? These are bad. Okay. What do you think about that? Hey, uh, calling card sent to my mommy's in do you think? Yeah, I think it's just the- it's just like the ones that the colors eat up. People online are saying the fantasies are behind this. They've already- the, the, the fantasy- uh, I think they're the real life superheroes. It's so cool. Look, it's the creepy girl again. <laughs> if it's happening twice, it's probably gonna happen again. I can't wait to see who's next. Okay, chills. I don't know why you popped in and just started talking to my mic, but whatever. Okay. Oh, there he goes. Bye, Chills. Yeah, sorry. He just like stepped in for a second. Oh, 
Yes. Oh, sounds like sounds like a lot of people are going to be on that trip to the studio tomorrow. Do you, oh, that's what's tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. Okay, we'll end it off and we'll save that for next time. Do you guys get to see the show too? I wouldn't mind seeing that. I like talk shows. Oh, the variety shows. I wonder if they'll talk about the Phantom Thieves. They certainly get plenty of attention on TV and the internet. Though I'm a little worried about what might happen if the media gets people too riled up. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh, that reminds me. Have you guys uh, covered totalitarianism yet? Totalitarianism, that's it. It's a governmental structure that unites the its people under a single ideology. I forget what his voice sounds like, by the way. And authoritarian control of the masses. In theory, it brings the people together under one ideal that definitely comes with logistical benefits. But it also means forcing ideals on people, assuming the unwilling. Assimil- Whatever. And that's how wars get started. How about you? Uh, how about you, Kerusev Kuhn? Where does totalitarianism uh, take things a step further with authoritarianism? Uh, hello, everybody. I'm Marco. <laughs> um, you want to answer? No, 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 no. I, I, I can figure it out. I can figure it out. Uh. I remember correctly, okay. I feel like it's controlling public thought. But I feel like that's also what totalitarianism is. Give me a second. I'm not looking it up, but I I I I, I am getting a text for someone. Okay, I'm gonna be honest, I actually looked it up and I still didn't get the answer. <laughs> uh, I'll say this one. <laughs> I looked up the definition of authority. Oh, really? Oh, okay. It was that. <laughs> I looked up the definition and then I, I just, like skimmed through it and it didn't give me an answer. <laughs> or anything close to what was shown here. Well, I'm surprised you got that. I thought you were stupid. Uh, yes, yeah, so the totalitarian government try, uh, tries to control the culture, morals, mor and even thoughts of its people to minimize dissonance. Dissidents? Dissidents? They try to assimilate uh, everyone into one ideology. Even reading the room can be seen as a form of personal assimilation. You all do that too, right? I try, I try to, though I'm not great at it. It's not a bad skill to have. It can even help you survive the modern world. But you can't do it too much. If you make an echo chamber, then the people whose opinions differ might get hurt. Yeah, okay, uh, Spice Bay, Salt Bay, whatever. Whatever you say. Oh, you actually do that? I thought he was stupid. Uh nice going. I didn't know you had it in you. I actually thought you didn't know anything. Uh, I already ranked up my knowledge, dude. I'd like to remind you all to keep a strong sense of self and an open mind so we can disagree and still live in harmony. I guess that's uh, it's over. It's it for class. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, plot. What are those two going to say? Time to get info on the students. Oh. Why do you think he's doing that? Probably because of Mr. Kamashita, right? Considering what happened with Suzuki-san? Huh? Huh? I heard Principal Kobayakawa knew about the sexual <laughs> abuse. just turned a blind eye to it. I bet he wants to snuff out any rumors now. Even the volleyball team was told to keep quiet. You mean to tell me he knows about his staff? So that's what he's using Mijibu's senpai for? <laughs> yeah, rumor has it she knew as well. Isn't that horrible? Chick's all noble about it, too. I mean, she knows now. <laughs> she didn't know back then. You 
mean to tell me the... What's the meaning of this, Principal Kolohakawa? Okay. Why did you post that notice? It was all for your sake. I thought the more information you had, the easier your investigation would become. And? Did any information arise about the case I asked you to look into? Nothing yet. I will pass the details along if anything comes up. Right now, there is a more pressing issue. It appears there are students at Shuchen who are being threatened by a criminal organization. <sighs> a student who saw your posting came to us looking for help. I'd like to request a countermeasure. Isn't this some sort of mistake? I can't believe this would happen to the students of our academy. Now is no time for such problems. There is still lingering concern regarding the Phantom Thieves. Oh, okay. I don't believe this is happening, therefore it's not. I'm rather busy at the moment. If you wish to do something, you will need to act on your own. Sir? Are you sure about this? I'm still investigating your case as well. Yes, that's correct. It works out perfectly. My intentions have borne fruit. This criminal organization must be the connecting factor. All right, she's still also a student, by the way. You'll surely find clues about the- In the third year. But that's absurd. So, let's say this rumor is true. Do you intend to ignore those students in trouble? Yeah, uh, yeah, uh, actual your student that goes to school and- easily If she were in your position, <laughs> my expectations of you are very high. I yep. hope you don't disappoint. You may be a child, but I'm going to treat it like you're actually an employee. <laughs> this principal's stupid. Yeah, but I mean, say what you want, it still worked on it. Oh my... <laughs> my remote was vibrating on the table. So we're going to push the... Hmm, I wonder... Uh, I guess I just had to be someone who's the talk of the town. It's quite a vague prison or per prerequisite. Sorry. Uh, don't we have any more specific ideas? Uh, an evil overlord. Dude, th this ain't some kind of video game. Oh, so the RPG stuff wasn't a video game? Okay, Ryuji. Either way, we'll need to- We'll need to lead before anything. We'll have to go to the look. Uh, the little things are- can I save now? Hey! Literally don't care. Oh um, what? Oh, don't be me. Oh, it's you. Okay. Well, we will go ahead and save. And we'll continue on with that next time. So, yep. Okay, well. That's the end of the stream, and since I didn't move around my mouse or anything, watch this. Bam! Oh, the game closed. I didn't have to be all special about it. So yeah, um, next time, yeah, next time on the Meta 7 stream, we're gonna hang out with her. Apparently, I guess we could do her social link now. Um, and, um, the Akechi fan club meeting starts then i don't know maybe tomorrow maybe i don't know i don't know what i'm gonna start i don't know i i do have assignments to do so it's possible i might not be live tomorrow just because of that um or even maybe the day after it it depends on how long it takes me to do them hopefully not that long it is coding though and that's not my forte so we'll, we'll see we'll see uh but yeah with that being said, thank you all for joining me. Uh, Persona week still going strong, even though I missed a day, but I really didn't, if you think about it. I really didn't, guys. I didn't miss a day. Come on, guys. I didn't miss it. Uh, and yeah. So, have a good day, or night, or afternoon, or whatever. And also, goodbye. I don't know. <laughs> and yeah. Um, also, just, just a reminder. Make sure to bring uh, next time to wear your foam fingers that say uh, a catchy number one on them for next time.